Good evening. Hi. My name is Cedric, and I'm going to guide you through the video of this tonight. Sure. First, could you please introduce yourself? Um, my name is Hi. I'm from Class A, yes, and we be from CC. Okay. And you? What is your name? Okay, my name is Vivian. I'm, uh, I'm from Class ESMB. Okay. And how old are you guys? Oh, I'm 12. I'm 14. Okay. We are going to start with a description. Okay. Hi. As you can see, there are two pictures. I would like you to describe what's happening in picture number one and describe picture number one in as many details as you can. Okay. As you can see, someone is learning how to do something. Okay. Can I have a close look? Of course you can. Um, in this picture, I can see the teacher is a woman and a girl, uh, they are learning how to make cakes. On the table, I can see a jar of flour, some eggs, and a mixture of egg, egg of eggs and flour. Uh, in the background, I can see an oven and the cupboard and the teapot. Uh, they, they look very happy because uh, I think this is the first time the girl learned how to make a cake. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Mm -hmm. I think that's all. Okay, good. Now for you, Mingyet, I would like you to look at picture 1B and again. This is a young teenager uh, and he's back home after school. Mm -hmm. Please describe in as much detail as you can mm -hmm. picture one. Mm -hmm. well, in this picture, we have a young boy. Is, is, he is watching a, a football match. And, and he's sitting in his living room. The room looks very clean mm -hmm. and tidy. And the young boy looks, looks very focused. Okay. Anything else? In part two, I am going to show you a sheet of paper on which you have different examples of activities that basically you and your friends can do on a day out at the end of the term, okay? You are preparing this day out and you wonder what is going to be the best way to spend the day. So I leave you maybe 30 seconds to think about it a little bit. And then after what I want you to do, guys, is to talk among yourselves about the best way to spend the day. Why should you do this? Why shouldn't you do that? And then we have to make our, our decision or... Yeah, only the two of you. Okay. I'm not in it. it. This is your discussion. Okay. So, yeah, we'll give you 30 seconds and then we start.
suppose. That's uh, when when we discuss, we have to choose uh, my own decision. That's only this or only this, or we can make a plan that first they can go there and they go there, go there. Of course, you can make a plan, and basically. You talk together about the different activities that are proposed to you okay. and you decide which one would be the most appropriate for you and your friend. Which one they can afford, which one they can't afford, uh, which one would be the most enjoyable to them. And you know, if maybe you would have time to do this or not, you know, try to make a plan as detailed as you can of a really the best day you can spend with your friends in the city. Okay. Okay? Okay. So, one, two, three, here you go guys. You can start. Uh, me and my friend, uh, if me and my friend visit to a capital city, we, we may enjoy going to the open market or go going on the city tour bus to see many relics and things around the city. Um, me me and the and many boys in my class enjoy football so I think watching the local uh, the local team play football is our is maybe our choice. I don't think we should go to the museum because the ticket to go there may cost us too much and the zoo will also cost the same price. So I think going on a city tour bus, going to a local stadium and going to an opening market is our best choice. Okay, well, I think first we we could go on a a, a, a city trip to uh, to look around the city mm -hmm. and uh, and and we can see the the beauty of the city. Okay. Um, after that, I think we go to a, a football match. A yeah, football match. Because all the boys are uh, like football. Okay. Mm, or or maybe we we could go to the museum. Okay. But I said that maybe the museum would be too expensive. What do you think about that? It's not so expensive. Okay, then. Oh, if you are a rich, rich kid, it won't cost too much to you, but I'm a poor guy. I'm not so rich, no. Ah, he's not so rich. <laughs> but your, but your dad or your teacher may, uh, they will give you money to go there, but my dad and my teacher won't. Okay, okay, okay. So, which activities do you decide together would be best? Do you think the city tour bus is the best? Because I think you can see the beauty of the city as you say, and we can take the bus to go anywhere in the city. Okay, so the city bus, it is. Yes. Okay, do you have anything to add, guys? Uh, maybe that's all. Okay. Right. Now, we're gonna go to the last part of the test. And in this last part, I am gonna ask you some questions and I would like you please to answer in your own words. Okay. So, I'm gonna start with hi and I will ask you the same questions after. Would you like to have more school trips, Hai? Uh, yes, I would like to have more school trips because at school I, I have to study very hard and I really don't have any time to rest. So more school trip, more school trips 
maybe the good choice. Okay. Mm -hmm. And where would you like to go if you have multiple trips? Uh, I would like to visit the museum uh, or going to a football match. Or if we, if uh, our teacher can afford, uh, I think we can go to the beach or go to or going to another city. Yes. Okay. Good. And you, my friend. Would you like to have more school trips? Yes. Yes, I would because I uh, I would like to have the the most most the most experience in my school in my school life mm -hmm. in more school trip is the best way to. Okay, and where would you like to go if you had more scholarships? I I would like to go to a camp. To a camp. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because when I go to a camp, I could learn how to do how to fish it. Mm -hmm. How to uh, how to make fire and. And how to uh, and I know how to put a tent. Okay, yeah. So you like camping basically. Fair enough. And tell me, if you would go camping, for example, what would you need to take for your trip? I think we need to take uh, clean water. Clean water. Food. Yes. If well, well, if if we go if we go overnight, I think we need some coats too. Okay, and you? What do you think you will uh, need? I think we'll need a knife, uh, some matches, mm -hmm. a tent, a, a sleeping bag, and some fresh food. Okay. Good. Now. Do you prefer to go on trips with your friends or with your family? Mm, I would prefer to go on a trip with my friend because I think it may give me more fun and I can play with my phone without my dad control. Okay, good. And you, what do you prefer? To go on trips with your friend or with your family? Mm. No, I, uh, I, I would prefer go on a trip with my friends. Okay. Because when I go on a trip with my friends, I would not be controlled mm -hmm. by my families and I could go everywhere. Okay, fair enough. And what do you think is the best time of year to visit Hanoi? I think the best time of year to visit Hanoi is maybe in the autumn. Mm -hmm. uh, in the autumn, the leaves fall down and make uh, like a beautiful sense of yellow and yellow and orange color. And it will be great if you take it if you take some photos near the Pangi Lake. Okay. 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 And you? What do you think is the best time to visit Hanoi? I think it's fall. The fall. Why do you think it's the fall? Because it fall. Um, In, in fall, Hanoi is very busy. Okay. In, it, and and it the best season in Hanoi. You could take a picture. All right, all right, all right. And my last question to you guys: It's which do you think is more interesting? 
visiting the countryside or visiting a city? I think visiting, it depends on where you live. Mm -hmm. If you live in a city, you may experience the busy of the cities and the pollute and the pollute and the polluted air. Mm -hmm. So I think going to the countryside, if you live in a city, is uh, is maybe a good choice. And if you live in a countryside, uh, you should go to the city to experience some busy in the streets mm -hmm. and some city works. Some like you can experience the city lives. Okay. 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 And you, what do you think is more interesting, visiting the countryside or visiting the city? I would prefer visiting the the countryside. Why would you prefer? Because countryside? when because when I live in the city, the air is 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 very polluted, mm -hmm. and and in the countryside, the air is. It's very clean, mm -hmm. and and I could play a lot of games mm -hmm. uh, in the Okay, good. Well, that's it. It's the end of the test.